guys, it's Vanessa and welcome back to my channel. I'm sure you guys missed my room. I'm not gonna lie, driving down here but was kind of super nostalgic for me, like passing by the exits I used to take, passing by my old high school, everything. It's weird, but I'm back in my old room where everything basically started filming one of my most iconic, I guess, videos on my entire channel, trying on everything in my entire closet. A lot of my clothes are actually gone, so I decided to make this one more interesting. I'm gonna be doing a trying on slash selling everything in my entire closet. Quick disclaimer, it's a little bit of clickbait. I'm not gonna be selling every single thing, but I will be getting rid of a lot of it. All of it is basically in my new house in Huntington. If you did not know, I moved. If you didn't know, catch up on those videos. I will be selling everything on Depop this time. Hey guys, this is future Vanessa popping in just to say thank you so much to Depop for sponsoring today's video. I have loved using Depop literally my entire life because personally, I like to find pieces that are very, very unique or things that I haven't seen a lot of on the internet because then you guys can always be like, oh my gosh, Vanessa, where'd you get that? And I'm like, oh, sorry, I got it off Depop, haha. <laughs> I don't know, you just find the coolest pieces on there shopping and you can also sell the coolest pieces ever and it's just a really cool way to buy more sustainably because if you guys don't know, I've been trying to shop more sustainably I've been trying to first number one reduce how much I buy number two find better companies to support and number three Just buy more secondhand because thrifting in general is one of the most sustainable ways to shop and Depop is perfect for that Because they allow so many cool like styles so many cool brands You can also support a lot of businesses a lot of businesses on there are small businesses They're just starting up and they start off on Depop, which is amazing I love shopping your small brands on there Like I'm pretty sure I bought some things from a couple of you guys Which I will try and link your stores down below if you guys want to shop my Depop everything from this video will be listed on there so it's in the description box down below if you click the link it'll take you directly to my store and you can buy all my clothes which is kind of exciting yeah um let's just get back onto this video and i will be listing them i don't want to say for cheap but like for very discounted prices if you guys want anything that i mentioned in this entire video it will be sold on my depop my depop is right here it's just vanessa Nagoya. so if you guys have never watched one of these videos before i have done a whole bunch on my channel maybe like five at this point i go through i try on every single piece and i sell them or i keep them that's kind of it these videos take a long time to film so we're just gonna get started. Also, I woke up at around 12 today and I drove down and I forgot I was not wearing a bra So I also did not leave any bras here because obviously I may take them with me So I have this bralette on that's not the best for trying on clothes But you know we got to make do with what we got. Yeah, let's just get started This is the first top actually it's hard to tie on without help I will be selling it next We've got this mint like off the shoulder green top Which I honestly did not think I was gonna keep so my mom bought this top for me for a video I feel bad cuz I know my mom was very proud of herself and she kept it But it's like I know I would wear it, but I know someone else would get more use out of it One of you can have it got this this is sophomore and I think I might have worn it once I will be selling this one. This is just one of those basic tops from Britain Brandy. I obviously don't shop at Brandy anymore, but damage is done so I can't like, you know, do anything about this one. So this top, I have one super, super similar to it that I brought with me. So I will be selling this one. It just has like a little knot. I don't know. I just don't think it flatters me, so I'm gonna sell it. This one's just very comfortable to throw on. I think I may keep it here in case I ever come back. I keep telling myself that I'm going to wear this top, but I have never worn this top and I've owned it for a couple months now, I think. This top is brand new. I kind of went through a phase where I wanted to like get like the little peplum. Oh, I don't even know if that's what it's called. I don't I don't know if I'm wearing this right. These tops that kind of like scoop in and go like that. I have to sneeze. I don't I think I'm gonna wear this. I haven't worn it since I got it. This top I thrifted from Brandy. I actually am going to take this with me to Huntington because first of all, I have a coffee stain on it. Pretty big one and I don't want to give that to one of you. So hard to zip, but like it fits, but it just, see look. It just won't zip, but I wore this once to a photo shoot at the beach. I have not worn it since that shoot. So it pains me, but I will be selling this. This top, my mom got it for me for a YouTube video, right? And I literally, I love it, but it's just, it's too big on me. The extra small was sold out. I could totally like upcycle or something. Maybe I can try that. This was one of my favorite tops like last summer, but I'd never wear it and I don't think I'm going to wear it. So this will be on my Depop. See, if I wore this, I would wear it for layering, but I would bring it with me to Huntington, but I left it here, which means I'm not putting on wearing it so I will be selling this white long sleeve I was also gonna do the same thing for layering but I did not bring it with me so I will be selling this this is a good piece but it's a good piece for winter and it's way too hot in my apartment we do not have any air conditioning so I will be keeping this but I'll be keeping it down here I feel like a librarian I think this top is one of the most flattering tops I own but obviously again it is way too hot for this maybe I'll have it for like the nights in Huntington so Hun Huntington so I will keep this black top same thing really good for layering except I I didn't bring it with me so I'm not gonna be ending up layering it I just put this on backwards 
But you can get the gist of it. I love this sweater. It's just way too hot for it right now, so I'm keeping it at this house. I've gotten so much wear out of this black, like, long sleeve top, but I love it. Every single time I put it on, like, I don't know why I got so much wear out of it. This is my merch. Obviously, I have to keep and support myself. I got this when I was in St. Louis. Favorite thing, like, it's so comfortable. This, I always say I keep it because of memories, but I still have never worn it, so I'm gonna sell it. I'm just finally gonna pull the plug. I'm gonna be selling this. Um, I bought this one from one of your small businesses. It's called Eccentric. Apparel maybe Eccentric clothes something like that I will find them and put them right here but I'm gonna keep this one okay so we're entering my sweatshirts and you guys know that I always keep all my sweatshirts right now it's too hot to bring but I will definitely be bringing them up in the fall so I'm just gonna speed put all of them on so ready speed trying on sweatshirts in three two one tell by my hair and my messy shirt I finally finished trying on my sweatshirt so now we're entering like my jackets and stuff like this is the most I've never cared about my appearance in a video I don't know look at me like I look like I just woke up because I did but gray jacket really like it but I will be keeping it for the fall same with this green cardigan I think it'd be really good to pair in the fall so I always talk about how I love this and how it's my school colors and everything I got this actually at Melrose but this just is very much like not my style and by that I mean like I'm not very retro I guess I'm very much girly slash trying to get into skater girl not skater girl trying to get into like skater skirt not skater skirts trying to get to like tennis skirts esque vibe so this just doesn't match so i will be selling this solid black denim jacket but i don't think i'm ever gonna wear it so you guys can have it and now we're getting into dresses so let me just readjust this camera so you all can get kind of a bigger better look i think this is good enough because none of my dresses really go like lengthy i definitely think that i'm gonna be selling like 99 percent of my dresses to be honest i just brought all the ones that i really wanted to keep oh i wish i could show you guys the whole thing i'm also too lazy to tighten the entire top let me actually scoot y'all back a little further there we go um this dress right here very very flattering i wore to playlist live but i don't think i'm gonna wear it again actually you know what i will keep this just because of the memory is so special to me that is like one of my favorite memories ever so i will be keeping this this is like a romper i really like this too so i will be keeping it too i'm apologizing i know i just said i would be selling a lot of my dresses but i promise i will be selling some just not this one. Um, I don't really like it on me personally. I just don't really think it like flatters me too well. You know, it's brand new, so one of y'all can enjoy it. It's just like this denim dress and it kind of buttons in the back. One second, I need to look at myself in my mirror. I will be selling this just because I don't think it flatters my chest area. Again, very cute. Um, I wore it on a photo shoot, but don't think it flatters my like here because it poofs out I don't know why so this dress I'm actually obsessed with however it is very see-through on the bottom half so I'm going to need to find a way to wear it. I'm thinking of getting like a slip thingy so okay it's very see-through so I'm gonna scoot up I really really love the design but I don't like it on me just because I don't like bodycon dresses too much super super comfortable though so one of y'all are gonna look totally snatched in this I promise go buy it this is a, just a very nice cute romper ties in the back like a little picnic print hmm I think I'm gonna get rid of it okay so so this is a very cute romper. I tied it too tight up here, so obviously it's supposed to be like lower and stuff. Very flattering, but not on my boobs, I don't think, because I don't like have a chest. Again, I really like this print. I really like this dress. However, bodycon dresses and I have like a love-hate relationship because I struggle with body image issues. So some days I'm feeling myself, other days I'm not, and I just don't think I'm gonna wear this. This is one of my favorite dresses. I think it's just super, super adorable and like cutesy because it's not a bodycon. It cinches perfectly at the waist and then like flows and yeets out. So so I will be keeping this. Very comfy, like, jumpsuit. I will be keeping it for the fall. Now we are going to move on to the pants. I hope you guys enjoy this lower angle now coming down upon me. These are the first shorts. I'm too lazy to button them. I don't like shorts that literally come with so many buttons. But my mom bought these for my outfit video. I like the fit of them, but I don't like the length of them. So I will be selling these. I love this skirt. I think it's so cute and it's super flattering on. So I will be keeping it. These are my comfy going out shorts and my designated eating pants. So I will keep them here. These are very nice to throw on just when I'm like going out So I will be bringing this with me. I got this thrifting it's kind of just like fits differently than I thought it would So I will be selling it brandy skirt. I don't like the fit of it on me But I will be selling this on my depop some comfy purple shorts shorts just to throw on I will be taking these with me to Huntington I don't really like 
the fit of it on me like I don't know I'm just not a fan of the length on me so I will be selling it okay and now we're gonna get into like sweats and pants and then we will be done I thrifted these sweats actually for five bucks and they are so comfortable so I'm just gonna bring these with me they sent me these jeans but they sent them to me in a medium so they're way bigger and they don't really fit me so I will be selling these brandy pants just not very my style anymore this just reminds me of my high school life brandy sweatpants again but I just bought like a whole bunch of sweatpants that are not from brandy and support better brands so I will be selling these two-toned sweatpants a lot of you guys liked them but I've only worn them once and I don't think I will wear them again so I will be selling these that was a whole for trying on I'm sweating so much right now and I have pants on me anyways that is it for today's video and if you guys want to shop anything it's all gonna be on my depop again linked down below and it'll put it right here and again thank you so much to depop for sponsoring today's video make sure you guys go shop my depop in the link in the description box down below yeah send me pictures if you end up buying anything from my store yeah everything will be listed on there when this video goes up so i hope you have a happy shopping yeah and that's it for today's video and if you guys liked it make sure you give it a like and if you really like me don't forget to subscribe comment anything you want down below and i'll see you guys next time bye breskies Running with you round these lancing. I got copyrighted, so enjoy this outro for now.